Erin Patterson says she wants to clear the record. I'm devastated. I love them. Revealing she had used mushrooms that she bought from the local supermarket, as well as other dried mushrooms from an Asian grocery store. Cooking a beef wellington at her home in Lee and Gatha on July 29th for four guests. Her former in-laws, Don and Gail Patterson, and Gail's sister, Heather Wilkinson, who all died a week later. Gail's husband, Pastor Ian Wilkinson, remains critically ill. In a written statement sent to Victoria Police via her lawyers last Friday and obtained exclusively by the ABC, Ms Patterson says she too was hospitalised, going to the Monash Medical Centre two days after the lunch. I had gone there because I had bad stomach pains and terrible diarrhoea, she said. I was put on a saline drip and stayed in hospital overnight. I was also given some medicine I was told was a liver protective drug. Ms Patterson says her children were not at the lunch, as police previously said, and had instead gone to a movie, eating leftovers later, which had the mushrooms scraped off. Police have revealed little about the investigation, saying Ms Patterson was a suspect and the deaths were unexplained, but not necessarily suspicious. Detectives returned to a Coonwarra tip last week to speak to staff, after taking a dehydrator days earlier. Ms Patterson says the dehydrator was hers and she did take it to the tip in a moment of panic. Police say the victims showed symptoms consistent with poisoning from death cap mushrooms, but they're awaiting toxicology reports. Ms Patterson maintains her innocence and says she is stressed and overwhelmed by the deaths of loved ones. Pastor Ian Wilkinson's family says he remains in a critical but stable condition here at the Austin Hospital. They say they're hopeful and continue to pray for his recovery. Sasha Payne, ABC News, Melbourne.